Hi everyone, I'm Carol Ann, your fitness expert from Wesley Chapel, Florida. And today I am here at Anytime Fitness to talk about sprinting for weight loss. The materials you will need are an open space, running shoes, and lots of water. Now, when you're trying to lose weight, it's a basic formula. You will want to expend more calories than you take in. So when you're looking at losing weight, the safest way to go about it is to lose about one to two pounds per week. So you will need to create a deficit of about 3,500 to 7,000 calories a week. So in order to do that, you gotta really boost up that metabolism. And one great way of doing that is incorporating sprinting into your overall routine. So what you can do is mark off a distance about 35 yards. And what you will do is start at your starting point and sprint as fast as you can for that 35 yard distance. And you could do about 10 sets of those. Now after each rep of running 35 yards, give yourself about 90 seconds to recover to catch your breath. No longer than two minutes. So you wanna perform that 10 reps. Another way that you can go about sprinting is that you can go for time. So if you have a treadmill, you can hop on the treadmill and you can sprint as fast as you can for 30 seconds and then take it to a light jog for 30 seconds. Sprint as fast as you can for 30 seconds and then a light jog for 30 seconds. Again, if you need more time to rest in between sprints, take that time, gather up your breath, but no longer than two minutes. So you can perform sprints on a treadmill, 10 sets of those. And again, remember, it's all about how many calories you're expending than you're taking in. And sprinting is a great way to boost the number of calories you're gonna burn in one given moment. I'm Carol Ann, your fitness expert from Wesley Chapel, Florida, and that is how you're gonna sprint and lose weight.